today we will configure trackers on uh, catalyst 9800 wireless controller uh, to IC. so first we have to go to configure and security and under the security go to the triple a configuration after this interface we have to go to the option tagus plus to configure so i have already configured tagus in here so i will go through what i have configured in here so i have to uh, here we can add uh, to add uh, our ic server so when we go to the add we will get some field to enter so already i have uh, configured my tagus server and so i will show you the details so here is the give you name you can give you with any name uh, for this tag server and this is the server ip address this server ip address is my ic ip addresses look this is my ic ip and so i have it here and after that we have to also provide a key so i am going to the add here so it doesn't give you any name you give the attack as a uh, ic server and give the key after that apply it and after that we have to go to the method list here we will create to get for uh, tech uh, for authentication so go to the same process go to the add and you will give the, the name of the method list and type is you have to select for authentication is logging and group is group and now you have to select the tag pg what we have are the given the name in server after that apply it and go to the authorization and authorization we have to select the type is execute exe and group is group and uh, check in the authenticated it's very important and also yeah, we have to assign it as a separate group with tech bg and apply that apply it on it no need to configure accounting for tech x now we have to uh, if is uh, inherent after is check you have to must uh, disable it uncheck it and go to the triple interface and triple interface we have to http we have to select authentication what we have created before and authorization also need to be select and after that we have to go to the ic and ic we will first create some rules for my tags so go to the org center and policy element under the policy element we will set a network condition or result and here is the tags common set so here i will create a tags command for wlc and select this permit any command that is not listed below uh, so when you check this is the admin access in your wlc and after that we have to go to the tags profile and we also created already it here i have to go to the tags shell and you have to give a give the preview privilege level of the uh, wlc so i give the admin privilege 15 and 15 and after that we have to go to the set and a policy for this and uh, wlc so i am here to set the give the name wlc and device i have selected the policy is here all device and after that we have to go the authentication policy and i have selected ad server is here so i have to reject it authentication fail if not pass is rejected is user not found from my ad it will be rejected and after the authorization policy in authorization policy i have select uh, my wc ip addresses in network access and ip device is my in this ip is my wc ip look this is my wc ip and after that i have to set the command set my wc command what i have previous created and share profile i have given the privilege so now we will go to the test my configuration work or not 
password so to see the log it's operation password fail you have to go to the operation and take a slide log and i have to set it here last five minutes so i'm trying to my first my admin admin which i have created in my wlc local user it should not be work look the wrong kid in shell is not working now i will try to form with my ad user also we will get a log yes we got a log and what the log it shows that it shows the atom detection fails are not going application identity store now i'm trying to user is my ad user and i'm to trying to go login yes it's successfully login with my ad user to the wlc so let's go to see the log hot the hot is the log showing uh yeah log showing that is successful authorization authorization pass also i hit the policy what we, we will create it and session authorization succeed and we successfully login with our wlc thank you so much